Welcome back to New Day Northwest. It's about time to head to the pumpkin patch and carve yourself up a magnificent jack-o'-lantern. But how do you keep your pumpkins from getting mushy, especially in these warmer than usual temperatures? Producer Rebecca is here to walk us through some cool tips yeah. that you found. Yeah. Now, I think it's important to point out that you and I both absolutely hate... It's the worst. ...carving pumpkins. Yeah. I hate it. Yeah, it's the worst. And you made a really good point. You don't realize how much you hate it until. Until you start carving it and scooping out the guts and you're like, why do I do this again? And then and your kids are just staring at you like, are you yeah. done yet? Yeah. Are you done yet? Oh yeah, no, they'll start. But then after um, like two or three scoops, they're like, oh, mom, can you get all this? Can you finish the rest of it? The okay. worst part too is knowing that you have to save the seeds because it's like you're frowned upon in the world if you don't. And I do love the seeds. They are but good. that is painstaking. Yeah, you gotta separate them from the guts and everything. All right, I'm sorry. That's cool. It. Okay, so if you hate it, you really want your art to last, right? Exactly, and so it comes down to timing. Okay. So timing. really, you want to not get your pumpkin more than two weeks before Halloween. So we're in that window now. All right, okay. Which is great. Okay. And then um, hold off on carving it as long as you can, but really seven to 10 days is kind of like your sweet spot. Okay, okay. all right, got it. Okay. So um, part of the reason why pumpkins rot is because they lose a lot of moisture. So one of the things that we can do after we've carved it, we've wiped everything down. Okay. WD-40. On what? You spray it. On the outside? Yeah, you spray. Okay. I don't even know how this works, but. Oh, God, don't you. <laughs> Give me that. You spray it like this. Okay. Like that. Sure. And then that helps to seal in the moisture. <laughs> now, one thing to keep in mind about that is that, um, Flammable. flammable. I was going to so, ask, so don't use a candle. Don't use a real candle. Use a battery operated okay. one. Okay. Let me say that again. If you WD-40 your pumpkin, <laughs> do not use a real yeah. candle. And maybe use a battery operated candle. And maybe know what you're doing before you start spraying well, the yeah, WD-40. So, so don't point it towards someone's eye. It's not my thing. Okay. Right. So the next thing is bleach. Bleach, bleach my pumpkin. Actually, so you, you you get a gallon of water in a big bucket like this. Okay. Do like two to three teaspoons of bleach. Okay. And then you put your butt your pumpkin in the bucket for like two to three minutes. I'm Before gonna just, or after I have carved it. Uh, either. It, oh, either. It, because sometimes people don't carve their pumpkins; they just want them to. Oh, stay I do. Out, so. I do want my pumpkin, my okay. Cinderella pumpkin. So stick it in there. Okay. Um, wait for two to three minutes. Bring okay. it out. Now, if you don't want to use bleach, because obviously, like if you've got deer or other sort of yeah. critters. Vinegar also works. Okay. Oh, that's um, good. And but if you're going to do that, you need to keep it in that solution for okay. um, a little bit longer. Like you also 30 minutes. say we only have about you know 30 seconds yeah. left. You say keep it moist and in a covered area. Yeah. So spray it every so often with a little spray bottle with water, oh. um, and then like you don't want to like leave it out on an uncovered porch. In the sun? Yeah, in the sun or even in our situation, like in lots and lots and lots of rain. Like, oh, okay. That's, that's too, much it too much moisture. Yeah. That's too much moisture. Yeah. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. These, I've always wondered yeah. about these tips. I've heard like whisperings about them, but here on New Day Northwest, we dig deeper and we give you the real answers. So you are welcome for that. <laughs> thank you so much. Thank Good you. luck to you with carving. You too. We'll make it through. All right. Well, thank you for spending time with us today. You can check our website for more of our content. You can always send us an email, share your thoughts, but most importantly, get out there and enjoy your new day. We'll see you next time.